Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In my previous videos, we have seen how to set up Grafana, Prometheus, and also Node Exporter. So we have option to run Prometheus, Grafana, Node Exporter as Docker containers. So in this tutorial, we are going to integrate Prometheus and Grafana. So we'll be using the metrics from Prometheus and can be used to display as a chart in Grafana. You can follow the instruction as you see on the screen. I have given all the details in the video description. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, like the video, share and comment. I'm using a CentOS machine on, on which Docker is installed. So if you don't know how to set up a Docker, please check my videos given in the video description or in my channel. So let's start a Docker container for Grafana first. So we can uh, use the Docker run command with hyphen D for detach mode. And let's give a name as Grafana. And we'll also map the port, which is uh, 3000 from the host and also from the docker container and we will be also using the volumes for a configuration so we'll create the grafana underscore config which will be mapped to slash etc slash grafana and we will be also attaching the volume grafana underscore data this will be mapped to slash war slash lib slash grafana and uh, let's attach one more volume, which is Grafana underscore logs. This will be mapped to slash var slash log slash Grafana. And uh, let's run the Grafana image. Okay, great. So we have the Grafana image running. So you can see using Docker ps command. And when you run the Docker volume ls, we can see the volumes attached to Grafana. So let's try to open the Grafana portal using the host IP and the port 3000. The default uh, login username is admin and the password is admin. We can set a new password. So on the dashboard, you have uh, an option to enter data source and create dashboards. Okay, now let's start the Prometheus. So I'm not going to use Prometheus as a Docker container. In my previous tutorial, I have already set up Prometheus using CentOS machine. So you can follow the same steps or you can create as a Docker container. So you can see Prometheus is running. So you can check the video description for the links for how to set up Prometheus. So let's access Prometheus on the port 9090 and the host IP. So if you go to targets, you can see I have uh, different endpoints added. 
so you can check out my tutorial on how to add a node exporter and other endpoints so if we if we go to the prometheus.yaml file you can see i have uh, added a few targets As the node exporter targets are down, let me start the node exporter. So the endpoints uh, will be coming up. Okay, that is great. So we have all the endpoints up and we have enough metrics. So let's uh, connect the Prometheus into Grafana. Okay, to add data sources, you can go to configuration and data sources or click on the data source on the home page and select Prometheus and we need to enter the details for the Prometheus server. So let's use the host IP and the port number. The URL section. So I'm not going to change another settings, just uh, try to do the default testing. If you are facing any problem with the connection, it will be because of the firewall. You will have to disable the firewall or you need to enable the ports for Grafana and Prometheus. Okay, now let's add some dashboard to the Grafana. We will make use of the Prometheus data source and we have the metrics, so we'll uh, use them to create some graphs and we'll add it to the dashboard.
So as you can see, we have created two charts, one for HTTP and another one for virtual memory in the dashboard. So there is another easy way to create these charts. So in Grafana, there are some pre-existing dashboards where you can just import them into the Grafana. So we'll go to this location, Grafana dashboards. From there, you can search for uh, node exporter dashboards and you can use them to be imported to Grafana. Okay, I will make use of this dashboard so you can see it's already giving some beautiful charts. So we can make use of that uh, ID. Go to the plus sign and uh, click on import. You can put the dashboard ID and you can click on load. Let's try another one as well. So we can use this one. You can search from your end, whichever you like. You can go there and click on import and you can bring the dashboard into Grafana. Okay, great. So we have imported a few dashboards and we have uh, good charts from them. Okay, to summarize this tutorial, we have successfully integrated Prometheus with Grafana. We have created charts and dashboard. We have also seen how to import 
the existing dashboard for node exporter i hope this tutorial is informative for you thanks for watching kindly subscribe to my channel like the video share and comment